Hey, collective. Let's do a collective general love reading for the whole collective. Uh, you could be any zodiac sign, any gender. It doesn't matter. Whatever comes out is what the message is for the whole collection. Uh, I hope this video finds you guys doing amazing. Uh, if this video resonates, please like, share, and subscribe. Also, remember to reverse the roles if you feel you need to. I don't know everything. I never said I did. I'm just saying FYI. Help me help you. Let's help each other. That's all I'm saying. So uh, this is a general, like I said. So please listen to your intuition and know exactly what is for you. Don't try to force it to fit because you will one day receive the message because there's so many beautiful messages out here through so many beautiful, talented, gifted tarot readers. So let's see, Spirit, what do you have for the collective here, Spirit? What does the collective uh, need to know pertaining to love during this time of the year in December, Spirit? What is the collective's energy for December in love? Spirit, show me the collective. All right. All right, so you got the magician card. Amazing. So see, this is this, this is very good, collective, to be in your overall energy. Ooh, look. Look at y'all. So you could be really in your emotions. You could be on your shit. I feel like you guys are not settling for anything less than what you deserve and what you can manifest. It's like you're in this energy where you like, look, I can have whatever I want. I have. I'm more than capable. If I want it, I can have it here. I feel like you guys are manifesting new beginnings in love. You want love and spirit say you're going to get it. You're going to be very, very victorious. I feel like around this time in December, there's going to be a lot of uh, invite outs, a lot of communication, a lot of flirting. Because look, anytime you're in your magician shit, it raises your vibration and it attracts people to you. So I do see that as long as you, you know your worth and you know that you can get things accomplished in your life, it sets you up uh, above the rest, so to speak. Uh, you could be riding high on your horse, honey, but it's okay here because you have love coming your way. Especially this magician card gives you a, 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 a courage. This gives you the confidence to go move forward towards victory. You have a lot of victory and success in your life, especially in this magician energy. Because like I say, well, once you know that you have the power and no one else has the power over you, it does put you in a, a more a confident way and it sets your vibrational energy in a way where people are, are drawn to you. So let's see, Spirit, what message do you have for the collective? I feel like someone is... Either someone is recognizing you're going to get start getting a lot of attention here. Or, like I say, you're getting a lot of attention here. But it's almost like you're recognizing that you can have. Because, look, your universe has said, oh, you, you get it? Well, then if you believe it, well, here it is then. So you have love coming your way. Some of you guys could be <laughs> expecting a baby. But I feel like your love life is about to pick up here. All right, Spirit, what else for the collective in love for December, Spirit? Show me the December energy for the collective. Ooh, got the emperor. I see the hangman. All right, Spirit, what else for the collective? So you could be really taking charge of your life here. The four of pentacles here. There's some, either you're resisting something, you're holding back from something here. Or you may be feeling like you're on the cloud. You on a high horse. You know, you don't have to settle for anything lesser than what you deserve. You showing up as a freaking emperor. But the emperor has love coming your way. Now you guys could be, uh, you know, in this, in this bougie energy, you know, where you are holding back from just any and everybody because in this six of ones energy, like I say, you're going to have a lot of admirers, a lot of people wanting to be a part of you, but I feel like just any and everybody can't get your attention because you're the emperor. It's almost like if, let, let's say if you are a masculine here, because even though we're not dealing with gender, we do have a masculine energy here in the emperor. Could be divine feminine, could be a, a older, wiser gentleman, or just a very, very wise person who is very, very settled and stable in their life. Uh, someone here who is well respected, um, you know, they have a lot of experience under their belt. They go after what they want. They're highly accomplished here. Could be an Aries here. 
It could be it could be that uh, a lot of people are coming at you and you like y'all tacky. You know, you know how you had a little sluts. <laughs> You know how you had a little groupies or somebody here who uh, know they ain't got no business hollering at you, you know, because cause you you on a, in a class all by yourself, but everybody going to try and you like, uh-uh, no, I, I can't even see myself spending nothing on that. I feel like, but something is going to get your attention here. You could be expecting a baby with this Ace of Cups, like I said here. It's almost like you're saying, I feel like you're, you're, you're proceeding with cautious here with this moon energy. And so I feel like you're, you're a choosy lover right about now. You know your worth. Um, you're not going to just accept anybody because they, especially if you are masculine, you feeling like, I don't give a damn how fine you is. You can't roll up on me like that. You know, you know, chick, you, yeah, you think you the shit. Well, I know I'm the shit type of stuff. And I feel like a lot of people getting their feelings hurt if they coming at you wrong. And it's to guard yourself because you feel like you're special. No one gets to ride up on you like that. Don't nobody get to come at you unless you invite them into your space. You got this authority energy going on here. Ooh, what's got, what we got here? All right, Spirit, what else for the collective? What's going on here? So it could be some hidden things here or the unknown. Eight of Swords here, so someone feels stuck. Someone here feels, perhaps. Makes a room. Give me one more card here for the collective spirit. One more card. The Nine of Pentacles. See, this is a boss. Whoever this is, this is a boss. Now, y'all could be in y'all boss shit. See, you got a lot of people watching you. And everybody feel like they can roll up on you because you may be, you know, the type of person who's out and about, who's friendly with other people. Uh, you could be at, at functions here. You could, your job could require, your business could require it. And you could have a lot of people, you know, your name buzzing. I feel like somebody is a very important person here and their name is buzzing. They they have a lot of attention on them and a lot of people trying to get at you. But you, you, you... You out of somebody's reach here. You know, some folks ain't gonna it could be too, is that you're 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 choosing this approach with people's because deep down inside you may still be hung up on someone else. So you feel like if you can't have the best, you don't want nobody else. It's almost like that too. Let's see what's going on here. So you could be dealing with a Pisces, got the magician and the moon card, Aries. You could be that. You could be a Leo, Sagittarius. A, a, look, everybody here, okay? Everybody is here. So let's see. You got the Page of Swords and the Queen of Swords. See, you got a lot of attention on you. People are checking you out. They probably trying to find out if you are single. That's what they're trying to find out. And you like, no, I just got out of something. <laughs> I'm still in love with them. See, that's what I feel like. I feel like folks are checking you out, trying to see if you're if you're single because you're such a freaking catch. But you, but little do they know, you still stuck on this person for somebody, y'all. Look, I know this how the cards going. You're still holding on, and it's like, it's like as far as your business and your your um your entrepreneurship or whatever you're doing as for a living as your 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 main time that you provide for yourself. You got that shit down to a T. It's almost like a very, very um, high-ranking person here is going on in life um, because they know their worth. They have a lot of attributes about themselves. And in the public's eye, they have to keep this, this, this image that everything is okay in their life. You know, and it, it draws people to them because people are trying to figure out if this person is single. You could be someone here who is well known here, or you just well known locally, or you just got this type of baller, uh, wealthy, wise individual energy here, and everyone is aware that you're now single here. Because I did see the tennis. So someone could be aware that you're now you're single, and they're trying to see. Well, you know, I heard that they broke up, girl. Girl, now you know he's single. I wonder if he's single. Girl, I wonder if he's single. I wonder if she's single now because. They seeing this nine of pentacles. They're not seeing you out with 
I feel like they not seeing you out with that Queen of Cups <laughs> no more. I'm just saying. Somebody want to know if you're still single here. And like I said, you keeping your game face on in the public's eye here because you always got people watching you. Always people watching you. Always people waiting to see what you're going to do so that they can talk about it. You can have a lot of uh, <laughs> reactors. <laughs> you got a whole bunch of content creators. They're reacting and you just moving because you feel like they're going to talk shit. If I, if, I, if I show them anything, so you could be very, very right. See, this is somebody who is handsome. This is an attractive person here. I see that this is a very, very attractive person here. This is someone here who I feel like their name is always ringing here. People are always reacting to them because I feel like this person gets a lot of attention. This could be a celebrity of some sorts. And they're 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 trying to keep their game face on and, and, and you know they they got their guards up. They're keeping their game face on like everything in their world is okay. But like I say, behind the door, behind the scenes here. This person feels just lost and just feel left out in the cold here. And they're still holding on. They're still holding on because I feel like this is fresh energy. Somebody in love with a Queen of Cups here. See, Knight of Wands. Okay, let's see. Now, let's see about this Emperor here. I feel like this Emperor is this King of Wands energy. Let me sit it right there. All right, Spirit, what's up with this Emperor for the collective now? For some of you guys, it could be a divine masculine here. It could be, but let's see. Clarify this emperor for the collective. Why is the emperor here, spirit? The emperor, <laughs> see? This person took a break out. This person took a time off from entertaining anyone else. This person just shut down. I feel like if they broke up with someone else, they're really in love with this person. And they got a lot of people who trying to come in there and, and fit them shoes. But this person like, uh-uh, I, I don't even want to interact. I don't want to deal with it. See? Ten of Pentacles. This person ain't trying to get this to nobody else here. They, they're not trying to. And I feel like everybody trying to come at this emperor because they feel like they are kissed. This is a very wealthy person, like I said. But behind closed door, this person is going through it, y'all. Oh, that's so sad. It's so sweet, though. But behind the scenes, this person feels weak, y'all. Because they, they know it's almost like everybody attacking them. It's like they got people throwing draws at them. <laughs> Folks showing up at their house and shit because they know that they single and shit. And they done put it all off because they know what everybody wants. Everybody wants this too. And they like, no, I just got out of something. But behind the scenes, this person's still missing their person. See? Behind the scenes, little do they know this person wants their old person back. They want their old person back here. Give me one more card for this emperor for the collective. See, they're guarded. Ain't nobody going to get to this person. See, that ain't nobody getting to this person. This person is stuck on whoever they were with is still in their energy. They're still stuck on them. And if anybody try to come in there and try to act like they finna play house and play misses or mister and, and fit those shoes, this person ain't having it. They said, no, nah, they didn't took a break. They didn't put all this shit. They didn't shut it all down. They said, uh-uh, I got I to gotta deal with this. Well, now, what's up with this nine of pentacles for the collective? Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn here. What about this nine of pentacles? Nine of pentacles is the four of cups. See, I told you. They ain't happy, but they mocked. <laughs> everybody trying to get them they cup, and they like, God damn, I swear these bitches the cup. They said same shit. Everybody had BBLs, and everybody, I mean, God damn, everybody want me to buy them shit, man. You see, this person, that you see in this picture, they got a cup in their hand already, see? They said, I don't give a damn about y'all. They, they still holding on. Like I say, they still holding on. This person still holding on. And they're still stuck on this person who they're in love with. And yeah, they got other, other options. Everybody trying to get to this person because they see this person as a hell of a catch. But they don't know, even though this person keep their game face on in the public's eye, behind the scenes, they're still in love with somebody else. They're still in love with somebody else. And anybody else cup ain't going to make them happy. It's not. I don't give a damn. They don't even want to pick that shit up. See, it's a burden to them trying to entertain and, 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 and fight off all these other bitches. I'm telling you because this person is crying. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, this person say I'm tired. You know, I got to keep on putting her off. I can't even go on a regular date. 
If I wanted to have some sex, I can't have some sex because y'all going to try to break the condom. Y'all gonna try to put something in my drink. Y'all gonna try to do me like that. You gonna you want your, you want me to buy you this? I mean, goddamn, I I <laughs> took you out and wind you and dined you, and I can't get rid of you. This person feel like it's a fucking burden, cause then everybody want to want to claim that everybody want to be claimed and cuffed by this person, and they like, damn, I can't even take you out, and now I gotta choose you. But damn, I got other shit going on in my life. See, so this person ain't trying to get nobody's shit. It's almost like they reframing from everything and everybody want it because this person feel like they're going to try to take advantage of them if they have sex. Or like I said, somebody's going to try to bust a condom or something. So this person's well aware that they have a lot to lose. So they moving. It's like this person like, damn, it's a burden here because everybody else cup don't compare to this one. See, it's a soulmate connection with this person here. See, they're missing their cup. They say they don't give a damn about the rest of them. They they want the, 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 them and they chat, they baby's cup. They, they, they sweetheart cup, see? Oh, my goodness. Wow. What they say, um, they say money can't buy you happiness. I, I, I feel like maybe this person here, maybe this person may have entertained somebody else or something. There was something in it. Something happened here. So let's see, can we find out here? But this is what it is. Everybody trying to come at them. Now, what's up with this moon card? Let's, let's see. Clarify this moon. Could be a Pisces or dealing with a Pisces. Clarify this moon for the collective. The moon, six of pentacles. So see, there's something coming out here about someone being gentle. Like I say, they looked at your person like a meal ticket. Everybody said, so I feel like this emperor used to trick off. That's what I feel like. And they had somebody was like, well, what the, well, what the fuck you doing all that for? Well, why, why you got to do all that? Well, I guess you don't want my love then. And that's what I feel like, see? Because it's like this person, like, you right, I messed up. Screw them other bitches. I want you now, but I feel like it's too late. <laughs> Everybody know. It's like the whole town laughing at this person. Everybody trying to come get them. All of the chicks that they that they probably messed around with in the past or whoever cup they drunk from in the past, they done kicked that shit off. <laughs> they don't want it. See, some secrets coming out about how generous this person really was. I feel like to other people. See, this person was out tricking us. See, because they said that they the magician. They can make whatever happen. There it is again. See, it looks like someone was too prideful and too arrogant, especially with this King of Wands energy. Someone thought too highly of themselves in their status where they messed around and risk, took a risk on some bullshit and lost the best thing, I feel like. So somebody who needed to have attention from all these groupies or all these other people, they ended up losing the best part of everything for these irrelevant people here, I'm telling you. See, this person was manipulating here because this person needed folks to make a uh, make a fight over here. See, this person had a, 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 a ego issue. This person had an ego issue, so they used their money and their clout and their position to manipulate people. They knew everybody wanted them. They was the shit. They know that they can make it happen. They wanted people, they wanted their clout to have everybody making a fuss over there because this is someone who really likes a lot of attention. This is why you have the six of wands card here. So you could have been the one that wasn't kissing all up behind this person asshole. You know what I'm saying? You could have put it out there and let them know, you know, I'm digging you. You know, what's up? But they may have made you feel like they didn't need you. Ain't that some shit? They may have tried to make you feel like they didn't need you. And then when you left their ass, now they realize just how cold and miserable it is without you. It's what I am feeling. See? This person don't want to mess around with nobody. They don't want to do shit no more. Look, they sitting around here looking like a simp. They looking crazy. Now, why is this Eight of Swords here for the Collective Spirit? Clarify this Eight of Swords. Eight of Swords, the Page of Staffs here. So, I feel like this one, you got the Page of Wands twice. This person is stuck because maybe this person was immature here. Maybe this person is stuck because they want to come back here. Could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Could be a Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces with this Knight of Cups. So this person could be stuck about, or they got you on their mind here. See, this person wants a relationship with you now. Clarify this Eight of Swords. What is this about, Spirit? The Sun card. See? 
So this person here is uh, well aware. So this person here is stuck on you because whoever the one, if you left this person here, then this person is stuck on you because they want to talk to you. They they feel like you're their sunshine. This person is in dark and gloomy places. So this person want to come in and tell you the truth. This person wants to bring clarity uh, after they have ended the third party. See? They're in. They cut this shit out. They said, no, bitch, you ain't getting no more wine. No, I'm tired. No, hell, I lost my good thing. I'm telling you, this is what it is. See, there's somebody finna, somebody cut, see? Because they're not going to juggle anymore. See, this is what it was. This is what it was. Somebody had a lot of money. Someone got a lot of attention. Either they had a, a nice business. Either they were a celebrity, a, a mega millionaire, a very wealthy type of energy here, a boss. This is a big boss here. And so they're used to getting their way. They're used to controlling everything. They're used to people chasing after them. They're used to people sucking up at their ass cause to get what they got. I feel like you didn't, the only thing you gave this person was love, real love here. But this person was think was so egotistical and arrogant that this person, you may have not showed them you may have not fought over them like everybody else did here. I feel like you didn't. And I feel like this is why this person uh, chose to go out with other people because they know how to get people to stroke their ego because they paying for it. And because it's, it's almost like this. I remember when I was growing up, um, it was a guy, and I was a little girl, but I was listening to conversations. I used to listen to my older cousins' conversations when they talk about their boyfriends. And I was a little girl, but I listened. And she said, girl, yeah, I went out with this boy and he had a nice new car, girl. And she said, he had that car clean. And he told me, I didn't even ask, he told me, he said, yeah, this is my pussy right here. This car, this car give me everything. And he said, I ain't got to do nothing but make sure my car clean and pull up and every, all the hoes going to want me. And this is what he told her. So this is kind of like what I feel. This is someone here who knows how to get that attention because they got it. They're the magician. They're the emperor. They're the king of ones. They take action. Very charming. They're very confident. Uh, they look good. They smell good. They flexing. They balling. They doing all those things like that. But deep down, they need attention. So they found somebody who was not chasing them, was not a fan. They was trying to love them. And so they, instead of them uh, admiring and sewing into this person, they decide to go in and get other people who can make them feel like they're the shit. And I feel like somebody's going to tell you that they were insecure. They really was insecure. They were insecure. Insecure. <laughs> they were insecure. <laughs> Like a pickle. <laughs> now, what's up with this page of ones for the collective here? Why is this page of ones here for the collective again? Clarify. Page of ones, ten of cups. See, this person want to talk to you. See, you got it right here. Page of ones and the sun card. See, this person is, is hopeful. This person is is, is this person is, is hope, having hope because they know that they they didn't cut out this other shit. I'm telling this person that they, they they did it. They really did this, see? Because they know all they want is money. They, they blocked all this because they know everybody just wants them for their money. For whoever you are, you just want this person for their love. And they was like, that's a, you ain't going to jock me. You ain't going to do all. You ain't going to chase me. You like, no, nah, I just want to love you. <laughs> Ten of cups here. So this person feels like you are their happily ever after. They can see a long-term relationship with you. But I feel like you didn't get had enough of this person and their big-ass ego uh, or is it really big? Or is it is it just that their pockets is bigger than their ego? I'm just saying. Clarify this page of wands for the collective. Could be a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces with this Ten of Cups. Seven of Coins here. See? So this person wants to make progress. They want to sow into this relationship here. I feel like this person feels like they need to find somewhere and sit their asses down because... This person is not stable. They're trying to, they got all this on their shoulder here. And I feel like this person wants to balance you out. This person wants to add. This person wants to go the king of wands again. See? See, if this person couldn't make up their mind in their past, in the past, they making up their mind now here. Because I feel like this person is not the same. This person is not the same since you're not with them. They don't even want, it's just ironic. Hey, when you left this person, I feel like you left this person when you left this person, now they don't want that shit. <laughs> now it's starting to, to, to be a burden to them. They getting on their fucking nerves. They starting to block their numbers off and shit. 
Because I feel like your person made themselves the go-to person because they needed all of this attention. They were tricking off. Let's just keep it real. They were tricking off because it's not tricking when you got it. And somebody obviously had it in this emperor and ten of pentacles. But it did not give them love like you did. So this is why they're trying to come back for this Ten of Cups. Now I got this Four of Pentacles. This person could have held back from you emotionally. Uh, could have even held back from you financially too. Clarify this. I feel like they're holding on to you now though. Clarify this Four of Pentacles. Four of Pentacles, Knight of Cups. See, they coming, baby. They said they in search of their sweet thing. They need your love. And this is something that they really, really had to think about. This is somebody who really had to get out of their own ego and really judge the situation on why, uh, on, on, on really what it really was. And I feel like this person here had to really look at themselves here. And when they get serious minded, they know that you're the one that is the only one that is marriage material. They feel like you're marriage material here. See? This person said they were just confused. They they had too many options. They they granted that they, they did. They said, but they're tired of this shit. They said they, they got tired of juggling all this shit. They're gonna have to sit their ass down for they miss out on the best thing that ever happened to them. Now you got this ace of cups here. Clarify this ace of cups for the collective. Ace of cups is the queen of coins here. See, I told you they say you look like marriage material. Uh Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. They said that you're loyal. They, they said, God damn, this whole goddamn time I've been overlooking you and you're the very one that I should be loving. But the universe is finna send another opportunity. I feel like somebody want to marry you. Somebody's having a realization about how foolish they handled you. Ooh, could be an Aries. Could be a Scorpio. See there, you got this queen of Pentacles. We know she's marriage material. So you, you found somebody who is not chasing you because they're making their own money. Or it could be just like I said, this person sees you as marriage material. But whoever this person is, they see, this person may not, this person may be focused on their career. This could be a very serious minded person here. See, this person wants this relationship with you. See, it's almost like, did I see the King of Swords? almost like y'all mirroring each other, so to speak. But I feel like your person has more emotions for you. But this person wants this Four of Wands, this Ten of Cups with you, this Ten of Pentacles with you. Because they got it, and I feel like you got it too. Now, what's up with this Magician card for the Collective Spirit? Why is this here? Pisces Energy. The Six of Staffs, see? See? Victory, success. They go to six of wands again. See, this is what they were doing. They were manipulating people because they need the attention. This is what this person was doing. Because you got the same thing down here with this magician card. The six of pentacles. See, everything was on their dime. They 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 used their you they used the power that they had in order to get the attention that they needed. Somebody needed attention, y'all. Somebody's ego constantly needed to be reminded that they were great here. Also, but this time, this person is watching you. They want victory with you. See, page of swords. So they're watching you now. Now they're keeping tabs on you. And once again, it could be people who's watching this person. They're like, now what you going to do now? You know, you got a lot of attention on you. People are watching your every move. Whoever this is, you got a lot of people who is watching your move. Especially if you had a, a very... um open relationship and everybody knew about what happened. Everybody is watching you. It's like everybody's watching you to see who you're going to choose. What are you going to do? Are you going to find somebody else? Because you didn't drop everybody, all, all the side chicks. Now, I also feel like you're trying to use that same energy because you want to get this person's attention. So you, it's almost like this person wants your attention back now. Now, now they want your attention when they wanted other people's attention, now they're trying to get your attention because now all they do is watch you. Is this what I see? Five of coins. See, because they're trying to figure out what to do because they feel left out. <laughs> this person feels, this person created this happy. This person, they feel left out of your happiness or they feel left out of happy because I feel like this person is no longer happy because I feel like they want to come in. Could be a Leo here. See, they trying to come in and get this Ace of Cups with you. This, per this is what makes this person happy here. 
This is why this person wants to take this leap of faith. And this is a realization to this person that you were the one for them the whole time. See, this person started experiencing tower moments. See? And so I feel like this person probably ran through a whole bunch of bitches, a whole bunch of dudes, just to realize you, well, what, what are you doing here? You, you about to F up your whole brand here because everybody watching you. I feel like a lot of people watch your person. I feel like they're just a, a well-known person here. They're trying to see, are you going to mess up? Are you going to be a fool again? Are you going to F this up? Everybody's trying to see because everybody know who really makes you happy. And this this person here who you're now you're stalking, you're watching them. Now you got the six of ones, your last six of ones. You got the six of ones twice in here. <laughs> the magician card twice. Clarify the six of ones for the collective. Six of ones is the eight of pentacles, see? See, they want to work on this relationship with you now here. Or they could be looking at you work or you could be... Re look, oh, there it is. See, I was wondering. Ah, look, the empress. See, so for some of y'all, this was a boss couple. This is why this person can't replace you. I don't give a damn how many other people they go fuck, give money to, get trick off with, and they need their ego struck. This is why you didn't chase their ass because you like, screw you. I, I get the same energy. And what? 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 <laughs> what? What? And so now this person's realizing that it's only you. you you've been the one the whole time. See? I keep saying this. See, now they want things to move forward with you. This person don't want it to be over. They're not, they're not over you. This y'all have unfinished business, whoever this is with. You and this person has unfinished business here. Both of you guys have unfinished business. But like I say, this person keeps their game face on during the daytime and it's emperor energy. But please believe at nighttime, they go through hell. Because they're lonely. They're trying to grow up. They're having these realizations. They're having tower moments about their emotions and about how they handle things and how they wasted all that time, energy, and money on the wrong shit when they could have been building something. But it's like, how do you give somebody something who has it all? This is someone who felt like they could do whatever the fuck they wanted to do. They didn't know your worth until you had to prove to them who the hell you are. I feel like someone had to prove to somebody who the F they are, because they must have went to fucking sleep. And I try not to cuss, but I don't feel like cussing. You had to show somebody who the fuck you was, because they obviously thought you were just like everybody else. And you like, what? But ain't nobody got to fuck you. Well, well, who are you? See, this is what they, they're not getting, see? Now now they're getting it, because you had to show their ass. Ain't nobody, you, you think I got to settle for your ass while you fuck around and do all this other shit? Everybody know we together, so you're going to be out there like that. Okay, well, fuck you too. And now their ass is living to regret it. Because I feel like maybe you move the fuck on. Maybe, maybe this is what they see when they see you, but they're studying you now because you still ain't kissing their ass. See, now you're on your high horse now. You're getting a lot of attention because for the good job that you do because you're very, very skilled. See, the empress. And you just, the shit is taken off for you and fast move. You move. Your life did not stop for this person. And this is why they're having this realization. Now, all the rest of them little chicken heads are still sniffing up behind this emperor, trying to get their hair done, trying to get their nails done and shit. But they had to, look, I don't mean no harm. Ain't nothing wrong getting a look. Look, I'm just saying. But you had this. Ooh, y'all, this could be divine masculine and divine feminine. Take it how it resonates. But this is what it is. Somebody had to make somebody put some fucking respect on their name because they got beside they self. <laughs> All right, collective, this is it, honey. This is what I have for you. So if this video resonates, please like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell, you guys. Leave me a high vibrational comment, and I will talk to you on the next collective video. Bye, collective.